Yo, 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 what's going on everybody? Stack Apples Jack here bringing you a brand new video. And today we are discussing LUS once again. And as you can see, up 1.5% on the day, sitting at roughly 9.5 cents per share. But there's a tweet released just moments ago that we're going to get right into. But first, as you can see, current market cap as of the 27th was 123.2 million with authorized shares in sitting at 2 billion and the outstanding share sitting at the 1.32 billion mark. Just moments ago, ILUS tweeted, we signed the engagement letter with our investment bank to deliver our up list and large acquisition plans. We also confirmed that we plan to proceed with the share lockup opportunity for ILUS shareholders. This and more announcements to follow through the wires. As you can see, furthermore, our industrial subsidiary QIND, of course, Quality Industry Corporation has made positive progress and will be updating accordingly. Also through the wires. Boy, oh boy, there's a lot of information in this little paragraph. But it's huge, this engagement letter. And then they also discussed the sheer lockup. They plan to proceed. And of course, there's going to be more announcements. But again, what exactly is an engagement letter in investment banking? The engagement letter usually provides that the investment bank will act as the company's exclusive financial advisor. The letter will describe the contemplated transaction and the scope of services to be provided by the advisor as well as limits on its liability. So, you know, the fact that they're doing this is huge and, you know, the letter has been signed. So massive, massive piece of news. This was tweeted on September 23rd. A productive week from the ILUS team, not only in Serbia, but also in Dubai and the US. Several exciting new installments planned for next week. Next week is this week. And we did have an announcement come that we'll get into in just one moment. As you can see here, lots of handshakes. Lots of handshakes. And look at this double handshake. You love to see it. So, on September 26th, a couple of days after that tweet was put up, they confirmed his first investment project in Serbia. As you can see, the, the subsidized for the first oil US investment project in Serbia have been secured and the mobilization plan is finalized. As you can see, this was the mayor of Kokak. Sorry if I pronounced that wrong. He said our city is proud to welcome Oil US International for a long term partnership, which is creating thousands of jobs over the next 10 years, the economy in their region. We're pleased that such innovative pro products will be manufactured in our region by our local people and exported to all parts of the world. It's a big statement, and as you can see, you'll love to see that long term partnership, thousands of jobs created over 10 years time strengthen the economy which you know there hasn't been much strengthening of that as of late but as you can see oil us has secured upwards of 8 million in government subsidi subsidies for oil us ev technologies and a further five planned investment projects are included in the company's approved phase one business plan for the region each resulting in their own substantial government subsidies but this big guys you know this is just the beginning up to five more and this is just part of their, part of their plan. As you can see, Oil US has secured a large site on the outskirts of Kukuk and also has the option to secure manufacturing facilities in, in those two places there. Again, I'm not going to try to pronounce it. I'm already pronouncing the name of the city wrong. And as you can see, the plan phase two project is considered by Oil US as a separate project entirely involving the privatization of a large government site and they are now preparing for its machinery and equipment to arrive in Serbia. But boy, oh boy, that tweet coming out just moments ago, I knew I had to get a video up. You know, plans of the share lockups, shareholders to be complete. You know, they signed the letter, the engagement letter. Boy, oh boy, this is big. And of course, ERT IPO is coming at some point. But again, guys, this is not financial advice. You have to do your own due diligence. But the big news here. You know, it should be insane revenues when the IPO comes, insane revenues as it is. But boy, oh boy, this is still the beginning of oil US and it is already big. Of course, guys, please leave a link, subscribe for more content if you enjoyed the video. I hope you enjoyed the video. Of course, have a fantastic day. Thanks for watching.